Welcome to this video. In this video, we will explain how to do parametric analysis with Abacus software using Python scripting. We want to model a unidirectional fiber composite. By modeling matrix and fiber as you can see in this figure. At the first step, we should find a Python file that is related to Abacus command that we are performing in Abacus environment or GUI. This file is in a directory at Abacus start. For example, TMP in local disk E. We can find this file by the name abacus.rpy. By opening this file, we want to see everything that we did in the GUI. We can copy this command and use them in our scripting. We start to model matrix at first. The name is matrix, three-dimensional and deformable, and by solid extrusion, we start modeling the matrix. We draw a rectangle from point zero zero to point one one. The dimension is not important now. And then extrude it by a depth that is not important. Now we go to abacus.rpy file and copy new line. This line related to our modeling of matrix. I copy them in a new file. At first, we should choose a name for our code. For example, parametric modeling. And after that, we could find commands of software here. Some commands start with session. This command could be deleted because they only related to tuning viewport and are not important for us. We can delete this command. Some commands start with from a module import. This commands import modules that are that will be used in our code and we keep them. And then we go to commands related to creating matrix. Two lines are important. One line creates rectangle and other create other extrude the rectangle to create a cube. We will define dimension of the cube by parameters. For example, W for width, H for height, and DE for depth. And then replace this number by parameters H and W instead of numbers and depths instead of one that is number. Now we have some parameters that define our cube dimension. These commands create a cube in abacus by our dimensions. We save the file. And can run it in the software. From file run a script, we can run this file and that create a cube with our dimension. There is an icon in Abacus environment that clear all features that exist in the software. The related command to this icon can be found is in abacus.rpy file. The command is mdb. 
the first command related to running the Python script by us and the next command related to the new icon in the Abaca software. We copy this command and put it in the first line of our script file to kill you all thing that exists in the software before running the running our file. In the next step, we will start to create fiber. Fiber is a cylinder, three-dimensional, deformable, and by solid and extrusion, we create a circle from point zero zero to a point on the circle with a favorable dimension, and then extrude it by any dimension. We go to file abacus.rpy and copy the line related to creating fiber. We copy this line to our code. This part of code creates fiber and we copy the lines. In this command, also we can find, find important commands which create circle and extrude it. This line creates circle. We change numbers by parameters and parameters radius and depth. The depth is equal to matrix depth and the radius should be defined in the beginning of our code. We can directly define the radius or define it by using volume fractional composite, for example 60% volume fraction and we can calculate radius of fiber based on volume fractional composite. This equation calculates radius of fiber from volume fraction of composite and dimensional matrix. After that, we can check our code by running it. This code creates fiber and matrix. In the next step, in assembly module, we assemble both, both parts and create the total composite by merging this part. At first, we should translate fiber to the center of the matrix. We only translate it by any vector. Don't need to be exact because we just need commands. And then we go to abacus.rpy file and copy lines related to assembly. Session is not important and from assembly we copy the lines and put it in our code. In these lines, part imported as parameter P and then added to assembly we can see that A is instead of total assembly and at first import fiber and then import matrix to assembly. And this line is repeated, we can delete it and the last line related to translation of fiber by a definite vector. The vector should be from corner to the center of matrix, therefore we put uh, half of width and half of y height to this vector. This binds related to assembly part of our 
modeling and then save it and in GUI we continue with merging two parts together and making a part by name composite we merge two geometry and we delete original instances from assembly and we retain boundary because we want to assign different material to each part we go to the abacus.rpy file and copy command related to merging these two parts We just copy the command. And no change is required. Matrix and fiber are merged and made composite part. Our code is completed and we have a part composite that related to Unicel of a unidirectional fiber reinforced composite. I hope this video helped you guys. If you want more videos of about good software, or scripting in this software, you can find them in our channel. If this video helped you, please let us know by a like, a comment, or a subscription. Thank you very much. See you in the next video.